Hey guys, Erica with a K here. This is going to be um, another Poshmark video. If I look like this or if I'm wearing that sweatshirt, it's a Poshmark video. Um, today's video is going to be on a newer thing that I just noticed on Poshmark that was not there before and it is the drop feature. So I kind of want to talk about the drop feature and why I think that somebody would use the drop feature. So, um, First and foremost, I have an entire playlist um, talking about reselling videos. Videos with me having longer hair are a little bit older videos. They might have a little bit of dated information in it. Videos with me with the shaved head are newer videos. And uh, we're kind of just going through this whole Poshmark thing together. I've been on Poshmark for a little bit now. And I want to share my knowledge with you guys because I love this stuff. I'm always open to uh, any kind of nice constructive criticism. If you guys have opposing views or different thoughts on reselling or experiences, always feel free to write them in the comments down below and we can discuss things as long as you act like a nice person. Um, your, your, your constructive criticism will always be met very well. So anyway, today we're going to talk about the drop feature. So the drop feature basically is where you have on the bottom where it says um, for sale, not for sale or drop. So drop would be something to entice people. If you have, um, just say something that's sold out recently and you're like getting it back in stock and you're like, you know what, I'm going to list this and I'm going to build some hype around it first. So uh, I'm going to schedule this to drop at a certain time. So basically it'll be unavailable for people to purchase. And then when you take it off that, then people can purchase from it and they'll know like when it, when it drops or they can be in line in theory online, but in line to purchase this product once it is available to buy. Um, so this is really great for things that are high in demand that you can get your hands on, uh, things that have sold out that you got your hands on, or just in general, if you just are not ready to fill the order and you just want to build some hype around something, you can definitely schedule it up to seven days out and then people can purchase it um, once it is available. So again, you have a seven day window where you guys can hold it um, on the drop. So basically it won't drop until you say what day it's going to drop within those seven days. So that is the drop feature. I do think it's really cool. doesn't really apply to me and my closet, but for people who um, have either a huge following, um, really do really like high end, highly sought after things, I think it's a fantastic feature. Um, really cool like fashion stuff I think would do really well with that. Not exactly, again, my closet. My closet is very much um, basic bitch closet. No, I'm just kidding. That was a joke. But I just, I don't really like do the hype around things, but I do understand why somebody would do something like that. So I think that's really cool. If you guys have had success with the drop feature, please do let us know. If you guys have not had success, a total flop, let us know down below in the comments. Uh, love to hear from you guys. Love to talk about these things. Love to hear a different perspective on people who, um, this isn't new to and people who want to talk about this stuff. So let's, let's do that. All right, guys, that is it. I love you guys. And I'll see you guys in my next video until next time. Work hard, dream big, eat cake. Bye guys.